major new improvement to TopSol 2018 is the ability to freeze operations. In this first sample, we're going to show you what effect regeneration of operations has. For example, we have simple coloring done to faces, and then we have to rebuild the sketch. Now, if we edit the color even here, let's make it yellow. Now we're going to click OK, and you know what, before I do this, I'm going to activate a little timer so you can see how much time it takes to recalculate this sketch. And by the way, the sketch is a revolved silhouette, it's a complex part. So as you can see, it took a minute and 22 seconds. I mean, that's, that's a lot of time. And maybe we had lots of edits to do to lower level operations in the history. So what you can do is now right-click on the operation, and through the contextual menu, you can freeze the operation in its current state. And what that basically means is anything you make change-wise below that frozen operation will calculate very fast, and obviously the frozen operations will not recalculate at all until you tell it to unfreeze. Now, and telling it to unfreeze is just a right-click away. Now let's take a look at a crazier sample. So here we have an injection mold, and you can see there's a lot of history in here. We've even organized the history into subfolders so we know what's what exactly. And what we're going to do here is we're going to show you how easy it is to freeze operations, as well as to show you that you can select things in whatever order you want. So for example, I'm selecting complete folders, then I'm expanding folders, and then I'm selecting other options within those folders, and I'm doing this all while holding the control key on my keyboard because, after all, Top Solid 7 is a standard Windows application. Once I'm ready, I right-click on one of those selected operations, choose Freeze, and what you'll notice is all of those things turn a light blue. That way you know what's frozen and what's not. Now, let's go make some changes. Now, the changes we're going to make, we're going to go all the way down to the beginning of time, and we're going to modify the mold base inclusion. That's at the beginning of the mold design, which should take a long time to regenerate these changes, right? But just by freezing the operations, we can focus on the work at hand. For example, a simple change like changing the thickness of the top clamp plate. That updated instantaneously because we did not have to recalculate all of those frozen operations. Kind of cool. Even making a material change still would have required a big recalculation. And as you can see, this is all happening in almost real time. Boom, that's done. Now when you're ready, all you have to do is right mouse button click and choose unfreeze. Like that, all of the operations that were frozen at that level of history are going to recalculate. And again, this gives you the control you need when dealing with complex assemblies, complex designs to really control when the software recalculates and rebuilds all the geometry. This is again a great example of Top Solid always working to put our users in the driver's seat.